Have you looked at the census? No. Are you not disaggregated? I don't know what. There's you... a space. There's a space there for a Haitian. <laughs> right. You can you can mark it. Why there's no space there for me? And I've been here longer than you. My people been here longer than you. Mm. Mm. <laughs> you shut me down. Let me let me just. <laughs> I'm not, not, but you can tell, but let, let me just. You ain't gotta look that part up. You can we can you can cut that out. Like nah, I'm keeping that shit in there. Can, <laughs> <laughs> that's fire. Everything must go. But <laughs> my point is this: everybody knows we're different. If you go to a Caribbean day parade, we know that that's y'all and that ain't us. You talking about Labor Day? Whatever. No, Labor I'm day. About, <coughs> when y'all have Caribbean day, wherever you are, it's called Labor Day Labor out here. Day, in New York. Yeah. We keep, yeah. Yeah. We don't. We don't. We don't try to say that's me. That's mine. That's my flag. We don't grab no Haitian flags. That's my flag. But when we grab an American flag, oh my God, y'all imperialists. Why you got that flag? Y'all trying to divide? No, we're just trying to say we're here. This is our country. We're American, right? There are a lot of people. Why do everybody get a flag except us? True. Why do people want to otherize us in our own country? True. You don't think that's divisive? It is. I can see it like that, but we don't look at it like that. Well, you should. We look at it as your country. We're the visitors, and we're just, we finally got like. It took Haitians years to get like what six floats. I mean, you know, they used to have one little float in the back. I'm just saying, like celebration. Haitians went through a lot when they first got here. Booty scratcher, disrespected in school. They used to call them Jamaicans. This is what I'm hearing now. You, the the Ados made me research these things that I didn't want to know. Well, you I just wanted you to be black. You should have just been quiet. Well, about reparations, you would have done nothing. I just want to be black and enjoy being black and fighting for a cause. What to do? I didn't want to know about I didn't want to be aware of any sort of uh, division or separation or the difference of comic or Karim Khan. And, I don't know what the that is. No disrespect. No disrespect. That's peace. I don't know. The, when they told me that on the, on the space, I'm like, Karim Khan? That's not like some type of... Uh, That's yours. I don't want to say they're going to disrespect. You're disrespecting your people? Uh, it's not, it's not, it's not, no, I, I, I don't know if my people really rock with that. I don't know if my people really rock with Karim I don't know what that is. Shout out to Karim Khan, but I don't know what that is. When did it come out? That's your stuff. You tell me. No, you I tell can... me. You no, know about all of that. That's That's y'all's reparations claim. That's <laughs> y'all. Y'all can go with that. But the reason you have to do it, Flip, it's not, it's not, because you have to, you have to figure out who is old reparations in this country. Okay. Like you, so that's, you have to have a category of people. Like, I don't even understand how we exist here. Like, you can have somebody who is a Haitian American, somebody who's a Nigerian American, somebody who's a Ghanaian American, and mm -hmm. we just get black. No, we've been here for anybody. We are ADOS. We have our own category too. Sure. And when you when you all call, if somebody says I'm a Haitian American, I don't have no problem with that. If somebody says, hey, I'm Nigerian American, I ain't got no problem with that. If somebody says, hey, my roots go all the way back to Zimbabwe or whatever, I ain't got no problem with that. But if somebody, if I say I'm ADOS, all of a sudden people say I'm divisive. Why? Y'all have been saying who y'all are and taking pride in who y'all are, but I guess got to be blackity, blackity, black, black, black. That don't even make no sense no more for everything to just be black. No, everybody has a lineage, and everybody should be proud of wherever they come from. Whatever your contribution is to your country, where you come from, whatever your traditions are, you should be proud of that. Be proud of who you are. But don't tell us we can't be proud of who we are and what we built in this country, because we did a lot here. Yvette, obviously, mm -hmm. no disrespect, but a lot of, I think, black people, ancestors come from another country. And a lot of times when people speak and say, you know, Adolf or some of the people speak, they make it seem like that part of their history is not there. We were here, I could trace my lineage four or five generations back, but your, your ancestors might have been brought here from some place. Some so, of them were and some of them weren't. So really, explain, I, I didn't know this. See, No, I'm just saying like- if, How do you know? So if you, just say, just say if you do your genetics, right? Yeah, yep, yeah. I did mine. I'm 70% quote unquote African, 30% white, European. Right? That's, I salute. That's fine. You can't tell me that I'm just African, though. See, see, you but look, 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 you, you pick it into even. No, I'm saying I'm both. I'm That's both. My things. Girl. Like when you talk about when when you think about the fact that slave women did mm -hmm. not have control over their own body. You're right. Right. Yes. You know that you are going to. That's why we run the gamut all the way from light as me to 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 really dark skin. We run mm -hmm. the gamut. That's why. So it's it's. People want us to kind of, I don't I don't understand the need of somebody needing me to be African. I'm an amalgamation. That's what it means to be American. That's what it means to be ADOS in this country. We are an amalgamation of different things. We are unique. So yes, yeah, some of our ancestors were came over here, were brought over here, chattel slavery. Mm -hmm. That's true. Some of them intermarried. Some of them would have would have would some of them come from women who were the victims of all of that yeah. is our history. That's what we're saying. We're not saying that like African slaves, like slavery isn't a part of that and, and Africans weren't enslaved and we didn't come from that. We're saying that it's more complex than that. Okay, but do you feel like 
some of the people uh, negate that part. That I don't hear anyone speaking about going that far, right? Like, why shut that part out? I don't hear anybody saying, well, yeah, like you said that I did my Gian, G, G, whatever that's called. Like 20, G, G, Gianna, G, G, <laughs> yeah, G, whatever. 23 and me. Oh, you did something similar. You trace your genes back and you said I'm African, right? And, but then you just said that don't tell, like, how is there caveats when it comes to being African? No, I'm just, no, I'm two things. I told you I'm two African things. African, but what I'm saying though is that when I hear a lot of ADOS talking, FBA and certain people, they don't talk about their ancestors that might have came here. They don't talk about that. They talk about five generations, my family was slaves here. So why do you shut that part out? Because does that make it a contradiction? If you, were to, if you was to admit that, and if you was to say that, well, if you go all the way back, your family wasn't born on this land. You guys came here. Does that defeat the purpose of your story? Does that no. defeat your, your cause? No. It doesn't. Not at all. Tell me why. Let me tell you why. Check me. I have Irish, UK. I have all of that. I don't go around saying I'm Irish. I don't. <laughs> when, 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 when the time, I don't go. I, I don't put on no little little. Like the Irish eyes are smiling. I, I don't do not no St. Patrick's Day, right? <laughs> so. <laughs> So like, what you want me to do on something else? I'm not, I don't own any of that. I don't own any of that. I don't talk about being no African. I don't talk about being no European. I talk about being American. Because when people come to this country, like honestly, Flip, let me tell you something. I know people who are Jamaican, who were Haitian in terms of their lineage, but they were like, you say, born here, this one born here. They don't even claim that no more. And y'all don't say nothing to them. They say, I'm American. That's right, local. and if you say, where were you born? They say, Harlem. You say, where were you born? They say, Miami. They don't <laughs> say, they don't start talking to you about Haiti. Like, we have been here 40 years. Like, once you, it only usually takes like a generation for somebody, into the second generation, that person starts to view themselves as American. And that's it. We've been here 400 years. You know how many generations that is? And people still won't let us be American. People still want to talk to us about Africa. Most of us never even visit Africa. We don't go back. Ain't going to be no year of return. None of that stuff is happening. So I don't even know what people are talking about. And here's the thing. People want to be mad. But Flip, we're Westerners. I'm sorry. Like, we don't, we don't, we don't, like, I don't think people understand. People say, I'm an African in America. How? You just have distilled yourself down to a part of yourself. You may have some Native American, and you may have some, you may have white, you may have whatever. You are not just one thing. We are an amalgamation, which means we are a group of a lot of different things. Don't tell me I'm just one thing. And we've been here too long for people to be like, well, you need this. I don't need to know. Like, Mark Lamar here was telling me where you, you know, and it was a great conversation. Well, we, we do a lot of the same things. Hey, dude, I don't need that. I've contributed enough to this country. There is no America without, without the slaves who built America. I don't need to go back and be like, well, our drums sound alike. That's just not important to me. I've built enough here. I've done enough here. I've made enough. My people have made enough of a contribution here. I don't need nothing else. I don't need nothing from Europe. I don't need to claim them. I don't need to claim Africa. I don't need to claim nothing. I'm American. I'm comfortable with that. Hmm. She's not coming to play tonight, bro. She hit. <clears throat> she hit swinging. Um, I don't like. I don't. I, I, I'm. I'm. I'm gathering my thoughts because I got. got some yeah. Yeah. She. She. She's good. <laughs> I, got some, I just. Feel, I. I feel like. I, I. I understand. We have to agree to disagree, but I do respect and I understand what you're saying. You're American. I, I got it. I accept that. I obtain that. I obtain that. G. Mm -hmm. You sure? <laughs> no, no. no. I, I, I promise myself. For now, that I, for now, you. I promise it. myself that I'm going to turn over a new leaf and respect other people's. Uh, <laughs> feeling. I don't want to force anything on anyone. 